Kristen Marie. Today we are doing a self tanner. I'm doing half of my body in a self tanner to let you guys know this is good or not. 95, 97% of the time I turn orange. No BS. I am that type of person that I peel, I get red, and I have no color. Okay, so I thought I would try it. You know what? I'm going to do half my body for you guys so we can actually really compare and test this over, yeah, a 24 hour period. Let you guys know what it looks like the next day. Is it worth it? Okay, so this is by Bondi Sands, the Australian tan. It's called Aero. It says air rated self tanning foam, light to medium, quick dry formula, intense hydration, coconut scented. So let's go ahead and just roll on over to that video right now. Yes, you guys are going to get a lot of TMI with my stretch marks and my skin, but hopefully you guys can handle it. Let's go ahead and just roll on over right now. I've seen a woman in a bra and panties, a full figured woman in bra and panties is gonna gross you out. Just turn off the video because this video is not for you. So we are gonna go ahead and try this right now. I just showered and I used a sponge on my body to exfoliate my body because the directions actually say that you're supposed to exfoliate your body before using this to get rid of any oils or anything or any lotions on your skin. But then the second step says that I'm supposed to use a Bondi Sands application mitt, which I don't have that and they didn't sell that next to this. So I just got like a regular glove. Okay, so I'm only gonna do the right side of my body because I really wanna compare like arm to arm, arm to arm, leg to leg. My legs are super, super white as you can see. Like I am like super, super duper white as you can see because I always wear pants but I thought I would do this on my right arm my right leg my right torso and see like is there a huge difference in color is this actually worth buying so let's go ahead it says it's quick drying so we'll see you know what guys I take that back I'm gonna do it on the left side of my body because I'm better with my right hand so I'm gonna do it on my left side here so you guys can see everything. So I think we should start off with the legs first. So I'll step back and show you guys in a second. It's a mousse. It looks like it's a mousse formula. So let's go ahead. I shook it up already and put it on. Weird. It looks like a turd. <laughs> and my hair is shedding. Okay, so let's do my leg first. Yes. This is my figure of about, I don't know, 190 pounds. So I am pretty darn hefty, but hey, what a full figure looks like. Okay, so let's go ahead and try it. As you can see the rolls, but we're not, oh my goodness. What in the world? Do we see this? This is like chocolate brown. Oh my gosh. I wasn't expecting it to be that dark. You have to say the fragrance is really nice it truly truly smells like coconut and no it's actually not like chocolate brown it's like a brown gray oh my goodness that is so dark so extremely dark like instant darkness. Look at this. Can you guys see that? You know what, let me put my glasses on so I can make sure that I can see that I'm in frame. Can you see that? Look how dark that is. I'm like, wow, I'm just looking at it in the camera. That is like, wow. So just have to move it around so you don't become streaky and don't ever forget to do the top of your foot especially if you wear sandals I'm just moving it around with a plastic glove to make sure that there's no streaks in it and I'm not missing any spots oh my gosh I missed the whole back of my leg can you see where I missed Right there. So 
I would have to say, you see that how you keep rubbing and rubbing? So the streaks go away if you rub it and rub it. The smell is really like intoxicating good if you like what coconut smells like. You wouldn't think so because of the color, but like super, super good. You do use quite a bit of foam on your body parts. Oh shoot, I'm not supposed to get on my hand tips, my fingertips. Do the belly. Yep, we got lots of stretch marks as you can tell. But that's what you get if you have kids and your skin just does not want to work with you. I should have never scratched when I was pregnant and I should have always put lotion. I did it. So I'm trying to do a straight line for you guys. I think if you're doing your whole body, like your back and everything, obviously you need some help. Okay, I am done. We're gonna leave this on. Take this off. The directions say leave on for at least six hours. Shower with warm water and gently pat dry. For deeper tan, reapply 30 minutes after initial application. So, I don't think I need another one. You know what? I'm going to take you guys to natural lighting. But I think you can see my leg. Like, look, right up here where I didn't get it. Like, here. Look at that. Look at that. Whoa. Guys, like, instantly, I am so dark. <laughs> but I'm going to go ahead and get dressed because I know you guys don't want to see me in my bra and panties. And we're going to get dressed and I'm going to check in every few hours and let you guys see how dark this actually gets or does it rub off is it really worth it because if this just like becomes all streaky or rubs off my body i don't know about that so i'll see you guys in a bit okay so all i did was put some baggy loose clothes on let me take the camera down a little bit thank you okay so all i did was put some baggy loose clothes on so it's not adhering to me so much uh, it is dry, look, but I almost feel like I have like a little bit of a lotion on my skin. It almost leaves like like a hydrating feel, but then it is humid today. So we have the stomach going on. You see it's loose on the stomach, it's loose on the legs. So I'll see you guys in a bit. I just finished up my makeup. I'm running out the door. I look pale in my face. Anyways, I'll take you guys outside to see what it looks like in the lighting. So I am at discount tires because on the drive here, I got a flat tire. So. This is a perfect timing for you guys to see in the actual sunlight with no shade what I look like. So here we go. Let's see here. I don't know if you can tell. Let me put the phone down and then back up and actually show you guys. I know the, my quality is, I know that I'm moving the phone a little bit too much, but give me one second to lay the phone down. And then I'm going to compare the arm to arm and show you my torso really quick. Okay, so this is the one that's done. This is not the one that's done. Can you tell a difference? So I'm gonna I'm gonna sit down in the car and look. I will be right back. So I honestly think there is a huge difference in color, as you can see. This is the tanned one. And this is my albino white. Look at that. And I think it actually looks really, really natural. It's totally not orange. Oh, turn off the radio. Okay, so this is the albino. Okay, so this is the one that's not done. This is the one that's done. Look at this. 
and it's it's totally like when I look at it it's beautiful because it's a beautiful brown like that tanned golden brown and 90% of the time self tanners they turn orange on me and this is not orange I think there's a huge difference from my actual natural color and my tan look at that not huge Amanda look at that that's pretty I think it looks really pretty it doesn't look streaky or anything um, as far as my stomach and my legs we're gonna look at that later but this looks amazing look at that huge 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 difference Okay, so Amanda and I are here at Petco looking at um, animals. animals. Yeah. Well, the um, the car is getting fixed, but I thought I would take you guys indoors and show you what it looks like indoors with indoor lighting. Let me lock the lighting. Hold it on. It looks darker. It's darker right here, right? Yes. Interesting. So I don't know if it's just rubbing off when I'm walking and it touches my clothes, but it looks darker here than here. I know you can see that. Or is that just the fold of my arm? No? Right here. Boom. So I wonder if it's rubbing off. Look. So you see this line? And then you see this line of... I don't know. I'll look outside. But check it out what we're looking at. Look at these guys. They're like going crazy on the little spin thing. And I am amazed that they can get up that high. So now I know why exterminators have a hard time getting rid of suckers like these when they infest your house. Isn't that crazy? That might have grossed you out, but I thought it was kind of crazy how they can just run on the wall like that. Amanda has a theory about why it's off in just that one spot. It was probably moving because she was moving her hand while she was driving. Yeah, here. so I laid my hand down on the side and it's like that. It's not plastic well it is plastic and I you know I moved my hand I laid on where the window is on the on the side of the door and that's where it lay so I wonder if I was moving it too much like she said and I rubbed it off so I, step, I, I stepped in front of the hamsters I think it's better lighting where you can actually see it right there so you see the line I don't know if I just missed that spot but I don't think I missed that spot but that is the actual spot that does lay on the car but look at the difference in color Thank you for lending me your light for a second. <laughs> okay, so Amanda actually had a really good point. So I'm in the car. We're back in the car. We're back in the car, right? And then this is where I laid my arm. And you can see it's black and it's hot. And it's like, um, it's not a, a, so a hard plastic. It's like this soft. And this is where how I laid my arm, right? So it's directly on that part. And any movement the my arm gets stuck to it like this because it's so hot outside and it's humid so it had to rub off from that so i'm glad she noticed that she's very accurate in her observation okay so i'm at karen's house and she says what do you say you are almost as dark as me but not quite okay so let's show my abs my six pack abs <laughs> <laughs> do you notice it from that? From, from where I'm at, no. Okay, so soon. But the arm, the arm so part. Come in close to show them my stomach. Hi, Dozy. You can just walk to me. I know, but I'm just zooming. It's easier. Okay, Dork. But you notice when you zoom in? Or yeah, no? no, not at all. Okay, so maybe I need to come over here. Okay. Let's just hold that for a second. Okay, so hold on. Let me face right here. So do you notice it? It's a little, I'm going to be honest with you, okay? You're a little bit red right here. And then on this side right here, it's like, I don't want to say it, but a little bit orangey. What, this side? This side is orangey. You think it's orangey? Orangey from this light. Mm. Well, it's supposed to get darker. Ooh, when you did that, do it again. Slowly turn. Okay, no, 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 no. Turn around again. Okay, now turn. There's a difference. Yep, you can tell. You can tell? Yep. I don't think it looks orange though. This part right here, your stomach part right here, yeah. That part, if you do it, it's a turn, mm -hmm. you can tell. There you go. Yep, yeah, you look can at my tell. Legs. 
Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Is it a big difference? Huge. Really? Yes. So do you like it? Does it look orange to you? I don't think it looks orange. It doesn't look orange here, but you look very tan right here. Oh. And then this one is like, you haven't seen daylight at all. Kaylin! That's crazy. Come hither. Huh? I'm going to call my niece over here so she can tell me the truth. <laughs> Where are you at? Oh my hey, Kay. gosh. This side right Come here, she off. is like white, and then she's so tan on that side. That's so job. weird. Okay, so tell me, stand over there by your mom. Okay. Well, actually, make your make your appearance on my video. Say hi, everyone. Hi. <laughs> okay. So, do I look orange? No, not at all. Not at all. I don't think I look orange. Okay. So now she says my abs look orange. I don't think so. Um, no. No, it's like a nice golden brown, right? Yeah. But you can see that line. Yes, I can. Okay, so come see. No, I can't see the line over here. I'm far. Hold on. You want me to look in the camera or you want okay. me to look at you? I want you to look at the camera. Oh, the camera part. And then I want Kaylin to come stand by me because she's really nice and tan. I don't see. I don't see. Oh, there it is. Yeah. When you do. No, no, no. When you lift okay, up so your come hands. On this side. Let's compare our legs. Let me cover my belly so I can hang down. Okay. So get next to me. Oh, wow. Look at that. See? I'm nice golden brown because she's not orange, so we're similar, right? Mm-hmm. So then I take sort this. Of. Oh my glasses! <laughs> so then I take this leg and I compare it. That's a huge difference. Whiteness. <laughs> so huge difference and then similar. Very similar. Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay. And now you got a bathing suit on, right? Yes. Okay. Can we? Yes. Okay. So my ab to her ab. Similar. Very, very similar. similar. Right? Very but similar. But then if she comes on this side. Oh gosh, you that's see it? white. Yeah, you're white. <laughs> <laughs> okay, look, nothing, arm to arm. Mm -hmm. I'm like red. Yeah, okay. weird. And then arm to arm. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm matching the same color now. <laughs> I'm golden. I'm golden glowing. <laughs> Door. <laughs> okay, so you like it. I love the color, but for some reason, the stomach area to me, when I'm looking in the camera, it looked orange for some reason, but. But in person, it does not. It does not, no, not at all. It has that nice brown, golden. Yeah, golden, yeah. Like golden brownish. Yeah, you're there. I've had the J-Lo tan. Oh gosh. Two hours and um, so when it wipes off, it completely wipes off like it did on my arm right there, as you can see, but look, it's gotten much darker. Look at the palm of my hand right there. It looks like a bruise. But that's where it's wiped off. That's how dark my skin has turned out. But that's exactly where I rest my arm. Look at that line. I'll show you guys uh, my torso and my legs when I get home for the dealership getting an oil change. Okay, so I'm gonna shower in the morning and see how much of this washes off. But I want you guys to compare my arms. Look at this. Look at how dark my arm is. Even when I step back, you can see one arm to the other. Even from a far distance, you notice how remarkable my arm looks. How toned and tanned versus like pasty white. Here you will see right here. So do you notice it's darker, especially when you turn to the side like that versus this? So when you have more color to your skin, more tan, like see, you notice the dimension right here. The, how it caves in on this portion and it does not, you don't really notice it so much on this one. But if you compare side by side, that's a huge difference, right? So it makes you look more fit. So even if you're not gonna put this all throughout your whole body, I would totally at least put it in the abdominal area if you're showing your stomach or something because you want to have more definition. So like I said, it looks like a solid one color. And then over here, you notice that that indention right there which makes you look more slender you guys let me know if you think if you see what i'm talking about the big difference from one side to the other right here if we're we're comparing like that's a huge difference from one leg to the other but you will see this like so you can see how dark i act i actually got so right here you can see it how it stops and i didn't take it all the way up so if you're going to apply this to yourself, make sure that you're wearing the actual bathing suit that you wanna wear and then pull it up a little bit more and then put it there. 
I really think, truly, honestly, that it came off on my arm. I mean, it's tremendous the amount that it came off on my arm. I'll show you guys some pictures, but it's like literally a line, a line. It, it, it's horrible. I would honestly say wait at least an hour until you uh, do any activities, you know, like put your arms down or rest your legs or anything on something. So it would be good to like put it on, you know, walk around in a robe or your bra and panties and then go clean the house. So I'm just, I'm just saying, you know, I was driving the car, had my arm down on that. Didn't think it was going to be a big deal, but with it down on the uh, side of the door right there, obviously it took it all off. And I went in the car after applying it, I think like 30, 40 minutes later. So it did that. It is an absolutely beautiful color, but I don't know if it's going to wash off tomorrow. It does say when you wash your body just to kind of wash and then rinse and pat dry. So I wouldn't say that you could use a sponge. I would say just use a bar of soap with your hands, lather up and rinse off. Don't actually like scrub or use a washcloth or anything like that. But I think that it looks absolutely amazing. It's just that one part that actually came off. And I, I think you can see it when I do that, how white it is. Um, Really, really pretty. But does it last? That's what you guys are wondering. And that's what I'm wondering. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Okay, guys. So I just showered, got out of the shower, did my hair and makeup. Now, let me show you guys my body. All I did was, all I did was I showered my body with a bar of soap and then no loofah, no sponge, no nothing. And then I patted my body dry, right? But if you can see, like, can you even tell? Look. So it's still tanned, right? It's still tanned, right? There we go. It's still tanned. Look at, look at my abdominal. So can you tell that they're still tanned over here? It's less right there. I think you can tell because like when I, you can see this definition still and you really can't see it here. So you can see that it's still tanned, right? My only thing is, let me scoot back here. Let's get this out of the way. My only thing is, let me face the sun so you guys can see. It's a tremendous fade. For the first time, me showering and me being so super gentle. Remember, did it shave? Did it nothing, right? My leg, nothing. Like, it, like it's a tremendous fade, I think. I mean, it still shows that I'm tan, but for, being, for bathing just once, and let me show you, it's still really tanned. You see my arm, how that looks so natural? That's what it looks like when I naturally tan. Then look over here, nothing, no definition, just bland, right? Come back, show you guys that beautiful golden tan. So I am still obviously very tan, but the fade, it dropped tremendously. I, I within the few hours that I had it on, it like, it got so dark, I looked so golden, and then I showered right now, and I noticed that it went down a few shades. Is it still there? Yes, it's still there. Is it still beautiful? It is still such a beautiful color. And no, it's not orange, guys. It's really, really not orange. 95, 97% of the time, uh, like these tanners turn orange on me. And this is completely not orange. I think this is such a beautiful, beautiful color. And the fact that it's so rapid, it's so, so super pretty. Let's see. Oh, remember this? Oh, there we go. So there you go. You can see still. So there's my butt, right? And there's the tan, right? So there's the, the stuff that we put on, the self-tanner. You can see that it's still tanned, right? It's just not as dark as it was yesterday. My abs, I think, look good. I think this makes my body look so much more fit. Um, personally, uh, if I use it on my face, I'm going to use it to contour my face. If you guys want to see something like that later, let me know and I'll show you how to do a natural contour on the face with this because I've never done it. I would assume that it's relatively easy. You know how a lot of times you contour your cheeks, you contour your nose, you contour your, all your face to make yourself look more slender. Well, if you used a self tanner, it would always be there. So you woke up with a self tanner, you went to sleep with a self tanner, you went, you went to bed and woke up with your face looking more slim. It did not transfer onto my towel. It did not transfer onto my bed and my bed sheets are white. So that is a plus, plus, plus for me. I actually do think that this product is amazing. And I know I'm saying that. Oh my gosh. Because 
I look so fit, don't I? <laughs> but it smells so good. It really, truly smells like coconuts, like pure coconut essence. Mm, it smells so good. Um, it's easy to use. I would, if I can find a mitt, I'll load, because it says application mitt. Um, I'll post that down below in the comments if I can find it. Um, but I did notice like with the plastic glove, like when I would, when I would pick up my leg and then I would be like doing this and stuff with the glove, that the glove was like slipping because there, it's not gripped onto my hand. And I would think that the mitt that they make probably more grips. So you're not having that slide, but easy to use. Didn't come out streaky. Didn't come out orange. You guys let me know what you think. Did you like it? Do you not like it? I know this video is TMI because you're seeing a full-figured woman that's pretty darn hefty uh, in her bra and panties. But I do these videos for you guys so you guys can see real results. So you guys can see, like, none of this BS. Oh, uh, you know, 200-pound model that has six-pack abs and... Uh, everything looks good on me. No, I am 190 pounds, guys. This is real. This is like, this is what motherhood looks like. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit that thumbs up button, little subscribe button, and the tiny little bell next to it for notifications of new videos. Mwah! I love you all. Thank you for supporting my channel. I love this product, guys, and I would totally recommend it. But let's go ahead and leave you guys with the quote of the day because we want to do some positive vibes out there. Uh, I'm Christina Marie. I'm out. Bye.